Welcome back. Santa will be here before you know it, and toys are likely to be the highlight of the holidays for a lot of kids. Families staying home due to the pandemic may be more in the mood to play than ever before. So if you are still looking for some great ideas for your kids, you'll want to hear what this next guest has to offer. Joining me now live from New York is Chris Bird, the toy guy, a toy analyst, a researcher, a consultant, and probably an astronaut. Who knows? Good to see you, Chris. <laughs> it's good to see you. I'm just a big kid, you know, and there's so many great toys out there. I brought along five just to introduce you to them. Um, this is Paw Patrol. If you have a preschooler, you know how important Paw Patrol is. This is Marshall's, Marshall's Jet. It's from Spin Master. It's about $14.99. It's a great way to bring this really hot television show to life. And it's, a, it's really good for kids, especially right now for social emotional learning. Plus, you we've got some pretty lights, too. Yeah, you've probably heard about the unboxing phenomenon. Well, this is a, a toy that unboxes itself. Now, you pull the tab, and actually it goes through a thing. It'll punch out the holes, and then it reveals to you which toy you've got. And basically, that's just the beginning of the process, because what you've got with Present Pets is just this adorable little puppy that you can play with. It's got all kinds of different interactions. And again, you know, it's, it's sort of the next best thing to having a real puppy. One of the things about play is kids want to feel big. They want to feel grown up and they want things like a smartwatch. This is Toby, the robotic smart smartwatch from Little Tykes. And he's got a little character in him. He's robotic. He's got two cameras. He will do things like big watches, like track your steps and, and interact with other watches on a safe Bluetooth network. But it's all stuff that's designed for kids four to eight years old. So they may be too young to have a real smartwatch, but this is a great alternative, and we've seen a lot of kids who don't want to put this down. Okay, I have been playing with this toy since January. This is, uh, this is Go Go Bird from Zing. It's actually Ooh. a real flying bird. Wow. It's a radio, you, you can't fly it in a New York apartment, unfortunately, uh, but it will go up to 200 feet on remote control. It's easy to learn, and the best part about it is it's under $40. We've never seen anything like that. That looks before. real too. That's cool. It, it looks like a real parrot. It's really amazing when you see it fly. And then finally, oh. um, you know, games really big this year. Again, this is called Pizza Party Throwdown. And essentially what it is is a spinning pizza and you've got your little pizza guy here and you are trying to leverage or to fling your toppings onto the pizza. I'm going to be cleaning these up for a year. But it's just a, you know, you, you fling them onto the pizza. This is from Hog Wild, about 1999. Well, those are good deals. I don't know about you, Chris, but when I was a kid, we didn't have things that were so electronic and so realistic. You were happy to get like, a, I don't know, some blocks, a triangle, and something you could play with. Or in my case, they had just developed fire and the wheel. How about you? I, I know, rocks were brand new. Rocks were <laughs> brand new. It was, but seriously, you know, it's all about the play. And one thing that's really important as we're getting closer to the holiday, really pay attention to ship by dates if you're ordering online because there has been some, some challenges with, re with replenishing stocks. So you want to make sure, get those letters to the North Pole now. Makes sense. Chris Byrne, toy analyst, expert, and future NASA astronaut. Thanks for being <laughs> here. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. Stay safe. All right, you too. For more information on any of these toys, go to fox59.com slash links. How about that bird, Jim? Yeah. That was cool. You just do a little...